Hi guys, I'm Harlequin. And I'm Local Angel. Today's video is about roaming. We'll focus mostly on mid lane, but most of what I'll say also applies to top and bot lane. That's right, so let's get started. Alright, so first I wanted to ask if uh, roaming before level 6 was worth it. Most of the time it isn't. It's quite rare to be dominating your lane so hard pre-6 that you can just leave your lane and not fall behind by the time you come back. Reaching level 6 before your opponent is more important than trying to help other lanes. Make sure you win yours first. Fine, so when is the right time to roam then? There are a few conditions that need to be met before you think about roaming. Your lane needs to be shoved completely so you lose as little resources as possible while you're gone. You need to be at least 70% sure the gank you're trying to pull off will be successful. Otherwise you'd be better off farming camps or warding. Preferably you'd want boots to make the trip faster and not waste as much time. And if you leave the lane you have to be sure you won't lose your turret for it. Alright, that, that makes sense. Uh, but what would be the best goal to have then when you roam? Well, roaming in general is to pressure other lanes during the downtimes in yours. You don't always have to actually be roaming. Just watch episode 4 to understand the usefulness of being out of sight. But for the times that you do roam, it's best to have an objective in mind like a tower, or a dragon, or helping your jungler invade. You want your trip out of lane to help the team as much as possible. Seems like there are mostly only good sites to roaming, so should I always be doing it then? No, for bot lane you want to think about moving out of lane only when you've taken the enemy tower. In the top lane there are plenty of ways to pressure without having to roam, but you can still do it if you're confident the gank will be successful. Now for mid, you might come across matchups that make it hard for you to shove, or you might be playing a mana-hungry champion and your jungler is being a jerk. There could be tons of wards on your way to a lane, or you might just be getting camped. Roaming is to extend a lead that you built to other lanes. If you're struggling, the safest gold is always going to be farm. So to recap, reaching my power spikes is more important than roaming. I need to make sure I minimize my losses when I leave the lane by shoving, and making sure I'm not walking into heavily warded areas. Boots are a good way to, to avoid wasting too much time. And finally, roaming isn't always the best call. I need to make sure I'm doing well in lane before thinking about helping other players. That's right. Basically, if you shove your minions and you're in no position to pressure the tower, you have two options. Farm camps or gank. Don't just sit there. Hope you guys learned something new. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, tell everyone you know, and we'll see you next week.